Hi guys, today we'll discuss about proforma for clinical examination of effect of posture on blood pressure. Here you can see in this examination you have to record blood pressure in lying down posture, then in sitting posture immediately after sitting and 5 minutes after sitting, then in standing posture immediately after standing and 5 minutes after standing. Let us discuss. First of all, ask the subject to take rest for about 5 minutes and then measure the blood pressure in lying down posture. Then in sitting posture, after that ask the subject to change the posture and measure the blood pressure immediately the subject is in sitting posture. You can see here because of peripheral pooling of blood here you can see systolic blood pressure decreases and there is no change in diastolic blood pressure. 5 minutes after sitting you can see here now the blood pressure comes back to the baseline you can see here. Then in standing posture when the subject is allowed to stand and we are measuring the blood pressure immediately after standing you can see here there is again fall in the systolic pressure and rise in the diastolic pressure that is again also because of effect of gravity and a peripheral pooling of the blood. And 5 minutes after standing you can see because of regulatory mechanisms your systolic blood pressure comes back to normal. Now, these are your systolic and diastolic blood pressure. Now, how to measure or how to calculate pulse pressure and mean pressure? Pulse pressure is equal to systolic blood pressure minus diastolic blood pressure. So, you have to calculate pulse pressure. And mean blood pressure that is calculated from the formula. Sometimes it is asked as MCQ. You can see here the formula that is diastolic blood pressure plus one third of pulse pressure. Now, let us derive the formula. You can see here diastolic blood pressure plus one third pulse pressure is equal to systolic blood pressure minus diastolic blood pressure. Again, mathematical derivation you can see here one third systolic blood pressure minus one third diastolic blood pressure. You can see here this becomes your two third of diastolic blood pressure plus one third of systolic blood pressure. So, to measure or to calculate mean blood pressure, this is the formula 2 third of diastolic blood pressure plus 1 third of systolic blood pressure. This is because duration of diastole is greater than systole. We can derive mean blood pressure by this formula. Thank you.